50s marked the first full decade since World War II, and East had changed dramatically since the early 1920s. A new generation of teachers took the places of many who had taught at the school since it first opened. Multiple sports activities began expanding more by 1950. East had its first curling team, and hockey became a varsity sport rather than a club. East had also won its first golf championship later that year, though there were a few complications here and there. During a basketball game, a fight had broken out between teams which made East as a whole re-examine the meaning of sportsmanship and teamwork. This created the Big 8 Sportsmanship Week, giving students the opportunity to truly understand each other and the schools around them. By 1951, a school band had started to gain popularity among their peers. This was certainly not a one-time event in the school's history, and there would be many talented musicians and singers that would attend the school throughout the years. New plans were brought up for a field bordering Pennsylvania Avenue, Unfortunately, the full plan never came to fruition. The school did gain a new cinder track and new practice fields, however. 1954 marked the true beginning of the next generation when Foster Randall, the original principal of the school since his founding, had retired in the spring. The replacement for Mr. Randall became Mr. Barrett, who had already been a math teacher, football coach, and the vice principal of East High School. He would now continue as the head of the school, while still upholding Foster Randall's policies. Outside of sports, multiple students gained recognition by a plethora of means. One student became popular for tap dancing at Madison Clubs, one student was well known for being the president of the Red Cross Club, and three students had made a name for themselves in the art department. In 1958, East had won the state basketball game under new coach Vern Belisel. Assistant basketball coach Mr. Floyd Farrell had passed away in 1954 unexpectedly after suffering a heart attack while announcing a basketball game. Three years after the tragic loss, Milt Dial had stepped down as the basketball coach. Mr. Belisel became the new coach the following year, and helped East defeat West High at the 1958 state tournament. This decade was a display of community growth, East was under new leadership, and students were excited for their future.